Roper St. Francis Healthcare's House Calls TV. For decades, aspirin has been a common component of heart attack prevention, but in recent months, the pill has come into question about its effectiveness and safety. Dr. Patrick Lucer explains what you need to know. The types of patients that we treat aspirin with are generally patients who've had heart attacks or strokes in the past. What we're trying to prevent is the formation of blood clots in the arteries that can cause problems like heart attacks and strokes. In general, what we would recommend is using a baby dose of aspirin, 81 milligrams. Whether or not you've had a heart attack or stroke, talk with your doctor before you begin an aspirin regimen. We know now in older patients in particular, it does increase the risk of bleeding. Now that we have better medications for blood pressure, better medications for cholesterol, and we're better at getting people to stop smoking, now we've kind of had to rethink aspirin therapy, particularly for patients who've never had a heart attack or a stroke. For more information, call 843-402-CARE, and for more House Calls TV, visit us online at rsfh.com. I'm Angela May. Roper St. Francis Healthcare's House Calls TV.